How do you put solar panels on the Chico 10 panel ground mount? Just finished installing this ground mount. If you haven't seen that video, go check it out. I'm going to link a video to this one that shows you how to step by step put the solar panels on the Chico ground mount. And now that I've upgraded my solar array, now my inverter is charging my batteries. Let me show you my 6000 XP. Here's where my two strings come in to my PV disconnect. And then here's where the two strings go out of the disconnect and then into my 6000 XP. You can tell it's running because you can hear the fans. If you look, you can see the kilowatt hours for PV1 and PV2. You can see the voltages. And then you can see we got a line going from the solar array to the inverter and a line going from the inverter to the batteries. So we are charging the batteries right now as we speak. And it says I have a usable power supply of 120 volts. So you can see I've got my load breaker on and it's powering this disconnect. And that's why I have lights inside the shed. Also, you see my SOC is very high. Take a look by clicking this button here, this button here, 99%. These were 0% for about two to three months. These are 48 volt DC, 100 amp hour batteries. This is a 48 volt DC inverter. And now I've got lights, receptacles, and I've got backup power for my solar powered mini split. This is a DC AC hybrid. And right now we can use AC power when the PV is no longer available. I link the video to this one, so go click that link. You'll learn how to put these solar panels on the ground mount, and then you'll learn how to hook up the wiring to the new 6000 XP inverter. If you watch that video, there's gonna be a link that pops up, and if you use that link, you can get $50 off your order at Signature Solar.